guys welcome back to the channel Yosh Crafter and today I have got my Boxing Day unboxing so I show you guys what I have been gifted for Christmas very very generously gifted for Christmas but first of all I just wanted to give you guys a little bit of a catch up um, I did mention that I was getting new glasses over Christmas so we went and picked them up so these ones are my distance glasses so when I go out or when I'm in the car so these are my new ones and they've got different um, like a tortoise shell uh, different uh, shades of brown and gold and so those are my distance glasses and they came in different cases this time they were, last time they were the hard cases and this time it's just the uh, pouches and these ones are my crafting glasses my close-up work so these are like a tan so yeah that's my new glasses so i just thought i'd show you those um and also in the post there was the next magazine the cross stitcher so i shall do a flip through of this in the next couple of days and upload it for you guys to see so i'll have that post so first of all i am going to start with friend gifts um so let's just have a quick drink of coffee just wet the whistle so uh, i put them all into a bag just to keep them together and show you guys so, first of all, I'm going to show you a diamond painting that I have been gifted. Oh, let me just get rid of that uh, pop-up on the screen. And no, thank you. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to make some room on the desk. And I can put it on here. There we go, I've just put them all together in a bag. So this is a B diamond painting that I have been generously gifted from World of Mike for Christmas. My Christmas gift. And also I got emailed a Amazon voucher. So thank you very, very much to Will of Mike, greatly appreciated. So thank you very much for that. Just gonna put these to the side as I show them. Put it over on the bed. Then next from uh from Dave and Gillian I got gifted a crystal craft uh crystal creations kit and it's a rose so thank you to Jordy dave dave and his wife jillian and their son so thank you very very much that's that one then from their other son dano I got gifted a crochet kit. I've never done crochet before, but I know a lady who has. So, <laughs> yes. <laughs> so, yeah, very, very cute. And we're going to definitely be doing the bees at the top. I absolutely love bees. So, thank you, Dano. <laughs> then... I also got gifted some things from 
is and um, Chrissy. First off, this is a card making kit. I've never again done card making or anything like that before. So it comes with some cards and envelopes and some stickers. So sorry about the glare, but yeah. Flower, uh, butterflies. Um, no, I don't think they are. Are these stickers? Or um, like you can do the uh, 3D. Yes, I think so. You can do the uh, 3D. But yeah, I've never done card making before, so thank you very, very much, Dave and Christine. So that was the first gift from them. Then I got gifted some cupcake bath bombs. So yeah, I'm going to enjoy having a few baths with these. So thank you very, very much. <laughs> then I got gifted a Lynx set. It's the ladies Lynx. But they gifted me that as well. It's a body spray and body wash, and it's the Lynx Attract for her. So thank you for that. And then I got gifted this Hessian kit, and I'll show you. I'll get the paper out. you attach the different um, things onto the bag, the different pictures and you cut them out and use buttons to attach it and there's a different design on the back there of uh, there's a different kit you can get but this is the animals you can just see the squirrel there. you cut them out and attach them on with the buttons that come and it's got uh, thread and all different bits and pieces so thank you very very much for that i'm going to enjoy making this bag and attaching all of that so thank you very very much then just a quick little one it wasn't a christmas gift but it did um come at christmas time and this is something my husband bought me but like i said it's not part of my christmas gift but we saw it and yeah we knew i had to have it so i will show you guys and it is a bee mug and it says be kind so it's got it on both sides so starting in my videos next year i'm going to have a drink in this a coffee or a tea uh, to record and then i can show it you know when i do my uh, end you know in a world where you can be anything be kind so yeah as soon as he saw it he's like yeah you've got to have that and you can uh, use it at the end of your videos be kind when you do your outro so thank you very very much darling for that so um i will get into family uh gifts so I have. <laughs> I don't think this bag is going to go on the desk, but I will try. So let's move some of these things, move my drinks along so I don't knock anything over. So let's put this on the desk. So, first of all, I want to show you what my, our, not my, our, eldest gift to me look at that 
he went on my wish list and looked uh yeah on my amazon wish list and he noticed i had these markers i saw these a while ago and they've been in my wish list a while <laughs> they're proper um alcohol markers and it is a set of 40 with taken all the plastic and everything off but there's a couple of reasons I wanted to get these markers um, one because they are the triangle shape so I find them easier to hold this, um, when uh, the school that I went to they had the red um, Bic writing pens and they were in the triangle shape and i found them so easy to write with so yeah that was one of the reasons i went for them because of the triangular shape i find them much easier um and the other reason is the fine tip is a hard tip it's not the um paintbrush tip it's the hard tip and then at the other end it's got the thicker you know the uh wedge end so you can do uh bigger areas but yeah a couple of reasons i had those in my wish list and like i said they were gifted to me by my by our eldest so greatly greatly appreciated and thank you very very much i've always wanted a set particularly in a case and it's like a off-white like a cream case and i'm not even going to try and say that name i'll just <laughs> the uh marker pen set and like i said it's a pack of 40 so yeah i'm definitely going to be uh coloring with those so next um are some gifts from my husband so again he went on to my amazon uh wish list he knew a couple of things that I really wanted for Christmas uh, one being my slippers and I've shown you my slippers but I will just show you the tag and these are Lipsy London so yes so yeah those were the slippers the slipper boots he's also got me a couple of the snap frames i don't want to call them q snaps because they're not true uh q snaps but you get what i mean and it's a set of two and one is a six by six inch and the other is an eight by eight so i'm going to be using these on some projects that i've got planned for next year but we'll get into that when i come back to floss tube in the new year and also some threads so some uh, dmc flossers and there's 50 different colors and then it comes with the little kit so there's the needle threader there's a pack of needles there's a seam ripper and a few uh, bobbins in there as well so that was a set of 50 and the snap frames so thank you very very much darling <coughs> so as we're going through the bag there'll be you know different gifts from different people so it'll be a, bit, a little bit of a mix match uh, yep that's those then gift from my parents so from my mum and dad so first of all 
they got me this gorgeous jumper there's white and pink but yeah absolutely gorgeous it's got the white at the top and then it goes down to the pink at the bottom so absolutely gorgeous i love this jumper it's lovely and soft so that's one gift from my parents then they got me a t-shirt get rid of the tag and it's just got the uh diamonds so yeah <laughs> very apt uh diamond t-shirt <laughs> Yeah, for uh, diamond painting. I never thought of that link when I opened it, but yeah, diamonds. So that was that. And then to complete the outfit, some jeggings. So yeah, some uh, jeggings. They got me. They look. They know that I love um, wearing leggings so yeah decided on jeggings so a complete outfit from them so the t-shirt the jumper and the jeggings so yeah wow absolutely blown away by those gifts from my parents but it didn't stop there they also got me a coloring book um this is by uh, does it say copyright 2020 I seek limited over the moon is an imprint of I seek limited it doesn't actually say an artist just said says lettering to color and this is from the works so looking at the tag up there uh art and soul it says just there art and soul so i don't know who does the artwork or anything like that for them but yeah art and soul lettering to color so yeah i'll uh, probably do some uh practicing and having a little bit of a colour with my new markers so that was from my parents also and then last but not least <clears throat> there was a box in the bottom of the bag so show you guys so First off, I got gifted a couple of the High Street vouchers, the Love to Shop. So, yeah, you can shop all through the High Street. Argos, uh, Boots, Iceland, Halfords, Waterstones, WX Smith's Shoe Zone. Yeah, the list goes on. So, yeah, the... Um, when I spoke to my mum later on, on Christmas Day, she said, yeah, the vouchers are for you to get a new toasting machine, uh, the toasted sandwiches. Uh, we wanted to get a deep filled one because they asked us, you know, what would you like for Christmas? And yeah, that's what we suggested. So they've given us vouchers to go out and get a new toasting machine. So yeah, I did that. Then, also, my mum mentioned, did you find a little box in the bottom of your bag? And I said, yes. She said, um, yeah, the, it was all your dad's doing. <laughs> she kind of, um, yeah, blamed him. But yeah, on the box, it says, a blast from the past. So I'll show you guys what is inside. And this is a Tamagotchi. It's the uh, animal 
things, you know, you have to feed them, play with them, keep them alive. And the reason it's a blast from the past is because me and my sister used to have one of these when we were younger. We used to take them on holidays with us when we went to the caravan on the east coast, you know, Bridlington and Bailey and all on the east coast. And we used to take our little Tamagotchis with us. And that's why, yeah, he put on the box a blast from the past. So, yeah, all my dad's idea, but yeah. Yeah, I didn't half laugh when I opened that. So, yeah, thank you particularly to my dad for that gift. Absolutely, yeah, blown away. And then the rest of the box is jammed full of chocolates. So, we've got um, the Ferrero Rocher. We've got some roses, celebrations, heroes. Oh, and I didn't know if it sits right in the bottom. There is a, it's called Ritter Sport and it's snowflake, uh, snowflakes, cornflakes. So I didn't notice that in the bottom of the box. But yeah, it's a cornflakes uh, chocolate bar. So yeah, I didn't notice that. But yeah, it's a nice little surprise in the bottom whoopsie and i'm throwing it all about so we will carry on so yeah a nice little treat box and yeah like i showed you guys it had the christmas tree lights so yeah that was that oops Put that there. and then Last but not least, some more chocolate treats. So, oops, trying to move some bits and pieces on the top. Just, yeah, they were just uh, bought, not for that Christmas. So, I will show you this first. If you guys remember, I did a gift unboxing the Reese's Advent Calendar from World of Mike. Um, this was, I'm going to show you guys what was in the last door. Uh, door number 25. And this was what the big door was and it's Reese's White so it's a pack of two of the bigger cups so yeah about let's let's have a look I'll open it up comes in a little tray and yeah it's a pack of two and yeah it's the bigger cupcakes so I'm gonna have a taste it's the white chocolate so it could be a little bit sweet mmm but yeah so very very nice mmm I shall finish that off later. Have a drink. So yeah, very very nice. So that was the finish of the advent calendar. So from my husband, I got gifted a tube of orange Smarties. I really do like the uh, orange Smarties. That's that one. Then a selection box, a Cadbury's selection box. It's got a double decker, a little bar of dairy milk, a crunchy, a whisper, a fudge, and a bag of chocolate buttons. So, yeah, nice little uh, selection box. 
So that was that. Then, uh, I'll do that one in a minute. And then also from my husband, I got a Lynx set and it's the Lynx Attract for her and it's body spray and body wash. So I now have two sets. But yeah, I absolutely love the smell of the Lynx for her. I do absolutely love the smell. So body spray and body wash. So yeah, two sets of that. Then, last but not least, I'm going to show you what our youngest gifted me. He's got me an A5 notepad and it's got the little uh, dividers in so you can write uh, notes and things like that sometimes um, if I'm watching other youtubers they'll uh, give suggestions of other youtubers to go and watch uh, recommended sites um, sometimes they'll say or mention if they've uh, seen a free pattern somewhere so yeah I can have this by the side of me and write some little notes and things like that from watching other youtubers so that was that and he also gifted me some chocolate too so this is called twin peaks and it's very much like a Toblerone but as you can see there it is dark chocolate so yeah uh nougat and chocolate and bits of nut and yeah so very much like Toblerone but this is called Twin Peaks and then he got me a bar of Bonville and this is just the classic dark Bonville so that's what I got gifted from my youngest um and I think um i've shown you guys the couple of diaries that i got gifted um i'll just do a bit of a recap so this was the diary that was gifted to me by my husband for 2022 and yeah it just a week over two pages but i can't remember if i showed you guys this set that I got gifted it was a while ago now but um, yeah 2022 and this is a set so there's a notebook and then there's also a diary in this one so um, what I'm thinking is make notes in one of them of what I was doing in the house you know, jobs and pets and stuff like that and then use the other one for like a project tracker so when I started a project when I finished a project and you know sort of what I've worked on every day so right when I've started on it and then as you know the days and the weeks and the months go on and what I've worked on every day um, and then I can give you guys a little bit of an update when excuse me when it comes to uh, floss tube so um, but yeah so just the little sections like I said I can write what I did every day um, so I split it up do house stuff and jobs and then use the other one for crafting so any stitching or diamond painting or uh, when I start crochet when I give card making a go so yeah all different kind of things um, so I think that is everything for today's video uh, just lastly show my uh, slipper boots uh, the ones from Lipsy that my husband gifted me. We got those out of the Avon, so Avon Cosmetics. And 
yeah, he knew that I needed some more slippers. So as soon as we picked them up from my mum, as we order Avon and things through my mum, because where she works is very near a uh, market stall that sells Avon and things like that. And you can, my mum orders through him. She goes to get a book. And so we're having a look through. And as soon as my husband saw those, and especially with the, I've got to show you guys, they're a little bit dirty. But yeah, they've got the uh, hard bottom on them, so you can go outside in them and, you know, if you need to nip to the bin or, you know, if you need to go outside and let the dog out and and things like that. So yeah, I got gifted those early, but yeah, they were part of my Christmas gift from my husband. So, um, yeah, I think that is it for today's video. Um, I need to do um, my weekly uh, plan again because um, last year um, I sorted out you know when I was going to do Peter Rabbit, when I was going to do the Peppermint Purple, what day the live stream was when i was going to do floss tube and yeah so i need to sort out what days i'm going to do what and when i'm going to be able to record because obviously i can't record through the day um so it'll be recordings on an evening and possibly over the weekend maybe the weekend during the daytime uh that was when i used to do the peter rabbit so peter rabbit will be coming back next year disney cross stitch will be coming back next year i'm going to continue with floss tube i'm going to continue my sunday whipping chats um so yeah i need to do a bit of a plan what i'm going to do when um but like I say, apart from on a weekend, I can't record in the daytime during the week. Um, helping my husband with things and cooking and house stuff. And yeah, taking a lot more of that uh, responsibility on. Um, my husband can do bits and pieces, even though he knows he shouldn't be. Like bending down to the washing machine or bending down to the dryer and... He shouldn't be doing things like that, but hey, yeah, that's just, yeah, but never mind. So, um, yeah, I need to um, sort out what I'm going to be doing when, but probably Peter Rabbit will be recorded over the weekend because that's usually when I, when I get the longest time when I'm able to record um, so yeah particularly the character patches because that all needs um, you know cutting round and ironing and so yeah Saturday afternoons is usually when I will start recording Peter Rabbit and then I'll finish finish it on the Sunday edit the video um for you guys to either see monday or tuesday depending what time i get to finish it off and edit and <clears throat> all that fun stuff of editing and uploading and but uh yeah that's usually the longest time i get is the weekend so that will be peter rabbit so that will stay the same and like i said either monday or tuesday when you guys see that video so i'm gonna stop rambling i'm gonna stop i'm gonna let you guys go so i hope you enjoyed that video and seen what i got gifted for christmas so remember guys in a world where you can be anything be kind bye guys <laughs>